Good evening, sports fans on this late Sunday, May the 7th, 2017, on a Sunday night. It is time now for Sunday Night Sports Roundup on the Sunday Night, May 7th, 2017, I'm Peter Wiggins and Let's Up at Target Field in Minneapolis, St. Paul, where the Boston Red Sox squared off against the Minnesota Twins, and the Sox got on the board first in the top of the third on the Desperador home run fireball there. Left field made a one nothing for the Red Sox. Then Andrew McBurner hits a two one shot in a five ball in right field. When Zeno Bogart scores, three nothing for the Red Sox. And then, top of the fifth, Mookie Betts over the line drive. The left center field makes a four nothing for the Red Sox in the top of the fifth. And then in the bottom of the fifth, Ali Williams out of second spot. The right fielder Mookie Betts that scores. Chris Jimenez and Aaron Rosario at the third. Four one in favor of the Red Sox. And then. Jorge Palazzo slings on line rider. Left fielder Christian Desco to eight retire and Brandon Bucks scores and Robert Chris for the second base. 4 3 Red Sox in the end. Kenny's Vargas out of the second spot. Right fielder Milky Betts, Brandon Christman scores. Jorge Palazzo to third base. Tied at four in the end. Top of the sixth. Sunny Leone. Over the line of five ball. Right center field. Mitch scores. Andrew Ramirez at six four. Fader to the Red Sox in the end. Top of the sixth. And then top of the eight. Mitch Moore on the single down. Ground ball. Center fielder Brandon Bucks that scores. Andrew Bennett. Nanny was seven four. Red Sox in the top of the eight. And then. Kenny's Vargas homes on the line of the wire. The left side of it. Trins get the Red Sox lead to 7 5. And then Eddie Rizzo out of the second left side of right fielder. McMahon, that's good. Edward Escobar. Chris Jimenez, third base, 7 6 Red Sox. But then in the top of the night, that's when the Red Sox conducted a hit train in the top of the night in Minnesota. Emily Ramirez, single out, ground ball to left fielder. Eddie Rizzo, that's the first girl. Then we'll go to third base. And we're bending in second base. 8 6 to the Red Sox and then. Mitch Morton, then was on line right, right fielder, Bobby Cross for that scores, then it was then and Benny Nate scores, and only remembers the third base, 10 6 to favor the Red Sox, and then Chris Young, that was on, sharp line drive, the right fielder, Bobby Cross for that scores, and it was and Mitch Morton scores, 12 6 to favor the Red Sox, and then Sun Leo, no was on, five ball, the right center fielder, that scores Chris Young, was 14 6 to favor the Red Sox, and then Zeno Bogart, three was on, five ball, the right fielder, Bobby Cross for that scores, Mike Betts, and Chase Young scores was 16 6 Red Sox to that. Mitch Warner walks, and Bogart scores on it. Aaron Vanini in third base, Aaron Vanini in second base, and the Boston Red Sox thrash the Minnesota Twins 17 to 6. As Chris Hill got the win, gave up four and four runs, and struck out 10. Aaron Santana got the loss. And next up for the Red Sox, they're going to be traveling out to Milwaukee on Tuesday for a game with the Milwaukee Brewers. We have two primary men for the Red Sox, and Willie threw out the man for the Brewers. Okay, look at some other Major League Baseball scores. Top of the seven this year. Yankees land in Chicago. Cubs 2 to 1. Toronto Blue Jays over the Tampa Bay Race 2 to 1. Miami Mons over New York Mets 7 to nothing. And Milwaukee Brewers over the Pittsburgh Park 6 to 2. Baltimore Reels over the Chicago White Sox 4 to nothing. Final 14 is the St. Louis Cardinals over the LA Braves 6 to 4. Cleveland Indians over the Kansas City Royals, 1 0. Then the Phillies over the Washington Nationals, 6 5. Final 10 innings. Kyle Rackies over the Arizona Diamondbacks, 5 2. Houston Nationals over the LA Angels, 5 3. Oakland Athletics over the Detroit Tigers, 8 6. And the Cincinnati Reds over the San Francisco Giants, 4 0. And the Seattle Mariners and over the Pacific Bay, Texas Rangers, 4 3. How about them Red Sox? Well, on the Celtics, on the other side, the Celtics. After struggling early on in the first quarter, made a decent run in the first quarter, built a lead of 12, and then the Celtics put a lead early in the third quarter up five. But then Washington Wizards would score 26 straight in the third quarter as a series of nap time. Two games to be that said the Boston Celtics got stumped by the Washington Wizards 121 102 to tie the series of two games apiece. Bradley Bill, 29 points, and John Wall, 27 points, and win for the Celtics. In a win for the Wizards. Wow. Isaiah Thomas had 19 points in the loss for the Celtics. Celtics and the Wizards go out of game number five for the Eastern Conference semifinals at the TD Garden. Okay. 227 left in the second half. It's Houston Raptors, 52. San Antonio Spurs, 47. And then Clayman Calvin is over the eight. Toronto Raptors, 109 to 102 to win the series. Four games to none. As now, Cleveland Kelly is on the way to the Eastern Conference Final, where they are wait the winner of the Boston Washington game. In the NHL, the Edmonton Oilers sports a game seven 
after thrashing the Anaheim Ducks 7 1, and the National Predators are on their way to their first Western Conference Finals in team history with a 3 1 victory of the St. Louis Blues. MLS Oars, Middle League on 2, Sporting Kansas City 0, and New York City Football Club 3, Atlanta Union 1. Atlanta 1. The Take a look at some sports news. The Toronto Raptors, those wonderful, excellent prisoner contenders, have fundamental balls beyond playing at the same company as LeBron James. Billy Barton once said that Reggie Jackson and George Steinberg once awarded the line and never cleared with a apology to Barton. The Mets slave shenanigans can be summed up especially knowing he's sitting around one taking an MRI and Mets. Harvey won't grow up. Telly Day, Alabama. On Sunday at Delegate Super Speedway, Ricky Senna's junior began the 11th Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series driver earned the first career race on a 2.66 mile Alabama track. In Houston, Patrick Beverly will be playing with every pound of Sunday night, just as before his huge weapons with set face and sent to the Spurs in game four of the Western Conference semifinals. 20 year point guard alone in this grandfather passed away. But the cast. But ask a casual golf fan about the fifth over 50 circuit of coming days, and he'll let you know that John Dale is once again rambling about to hang out one shot win the Inspiring Invitational. <laughs> After the victory over Jazz, both Duran and Stephen Curry took the reporting midfield question when they fight before the team, and they lost an extra fight about the Garfuffle. Anthony Wagner finally earned their victory over the Jose Mono as a son of. Be the depleted Manchester United team and now more EPL. Oh, Salt Lake State this isn't about basketball for Bob Myers, it's about friendship on Bob Warriors owner Joel Lekov's comments about Steve Kerr's return back to the Myers push the top of the back of the reverse on Sunday and ex postman Mike Santoni wins Michael H. Gold at NBCA call to the year award. And that is going to be it for Spots Random on this late Sunday night. May 7, 2017. Have a good night. And I'll see you tomorrow night. I hope y'all have a good night.